Hi everybody, this is Suzanne Wagner and welcome to the Intuitive Patterns for the month of February 2018. So in this moment of 2018, a time of coldness, winter, stillness, be grateful for what remains. This is a time when you learn to accept what cannot be changed and look beyond the immediate future for your personal hope and satisfaction. Worrying will not change the situation. Such times are designed to catapult us into a new world because of the sheer horror and magnitude of the scale of dysfunction. Yes, I know. You are all thinking, oh, it's Valentine's Day and this is going to be an article about the rekindling of love and romance. But this month is, it's kind of more important to rekindle your own clarity mystical power, and personal center. From that place, you will have something authentic to give and share with the world. This is a time to reassess and restructure. Certain types of pain are designed to motivate you past the disappointment and into positive action. You might be noticing how comfortably stuck and complacent you have been. But now, it feels as if all the stuffing in your sofa has collapsed and you are sitting on hard wood. At what point are you going to get up and get moving? Many years ago, my sister and I were at Shanghai Teachers University, and the beds were literally box springs on top of a slab of wood covered with a slightly quilted cover. It felt like you were sleeping on a bouncy wood frame. Every morning at 5 a.m., the students got up and marched out into the soccer field and did exercise. Our comment was that the beds were so uncomfortable that the only thing you could do for your sanity was to get up and get moving to feel better. Staying in that bed felt like torture. This month might feel just like that moment. Being still and not moving or changing is about to feel like torture. You're going to have to move just to feel better. You're going to have to do anything else. You cannot keep hiding your head in the sand and staying asleep. There is another way, but there is only one way, change. Life is at a cosmic impasse. You cannot go the way you have always gone. That road is washed out and at a dead end. The problems might seem insurmountable, but there is a solution or a series of solutions. You just have to not give up and have the courage to find them. Your personal desires are being repeatedly obstructed and interfered with, in case you didn't notice. What life is attempting to show you is where you are doing patterns that construct your own prison. And that prison is your own ignorance. You are in a prison created by your mind on the present circumstances. But what your mind believes is not necessarily real. Step back from trying to figure it out and step forward into the dance that is emerging out of your experience. I use the model of dance because through expressing what you feel inside, you feel less trapped or imprisoned on the outside. Expression is liberation. Trust that fate does have something worked out. Do not hold back what you have to offer even if you feel as if what you offer is not enough. When you give from the place that is authentic, it grows exponentially. You are, you know, you're in a period that asks for your hard work and effort. You will be rewarded at a different time, but that time is not yet. So give from the place of joy in who and what you are. Give from the place of unconditional service and compassion. Give just because you have something to offer, and that in that moment is and always will be enough. It is when life strips you down and tears off your ego that you find the vision you have been seeking. Self-doubt leads to wallowing and feeling sorry for yourself, and that road only leads to more barren and desolate landscapes. You are learning that change comes when it is ready, not when you wish it to be. There are so many leaders whose personal powerlessness and insecurity chooses aggressively to lash out in a neurotic frenzy like a rabid dog. 
But the way through this time is not respond is to not respond to aggression with more aggression. It is a time to be the crazy warrior who goes into battle with no weapons, only a shield. You cannot get to where you wish to go through force of will at this time. Only healing, trust, innocence, and love have the power to balance out the suffering and the mayhem that so many are experiencing in the world right now. When you have the strength and faith on the inside, you will abandon your old ways and move toward deeper intimacy and kindness. Anything else will not, will not feel life fulfilling. Anything that takes away centeredness, synergy, galactic alignment, and a fluid world resonance is no longer acceptable. Learn to observe the present moment without drawing conclusions. A larger pattern is emerging and you can be a part of its unfoldment. But your ticket to get on this boat is the ability to stay centered in the tumultuous waves of this storm of transformation. You cannot be afraid of the storm. You must learn to move and flow with the storm. Thanks everybody. Have a great month.